and down the stretch we come. We are almost at the uh, the last stretch of the NFL's pickup season for 2023-2024. Then after this week's games, there will just be the uh, wild card, uh, wild card, and or they they call it wild card weekend, and then the divisional rounds. Uh, the Chiefs does have the AFC West title uh, up on lock. Um, after their uh, experience with the Bengals on New Year's Eve, and we're still waiting on who else is going to be the wild card and the divisional uh, play uh, divisional uh, round choices. So with that, and another thing is there's no Thursday night action. So this is going to be a really short NFL pickup. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, the, the, um, you know, the prediction part. So this is going to be really short. So, uh, as far as college, I haven't made an, an, an announcement of where I'm going to college, but I do have some top schools and some have been added, some have been disadded, but, um, one of the top choices are Liberty University, uh, which is a Christian school in Lakeford, Virginia, um, Pierce College in Philadelphia, uh, Upper Iowa University, and what was it? Was another one, but uh, there was also Lone Star uh, College in Texas, but uh, yeah, I had a little brain freeze there because <laughs> anyway. So, but those are the top choice college in. Oh yeah, and University of Arizona Global Campus. So, they're the top school there. Uh, but anyway, those will be talked about later. Right now, um, I'm going to get with the NFL pickup of Week 18. Like I said before, there is no Thursday night matchup. There's no Thursday night football. Let's see if there's a Monday night there. Uh, no, it's all so, it's all. Wow, it's all Saturday and Sunday, so there's not even a Monday Night Football either. Okay. All righty. So, here we go. This will be a short NFL pickup. Okay, so, uh, oh, last week was a Sunday night, too. Okay. Anyway, um, the Steelers versus the Raiders, that will be a Saturday at 3.30 p.m. game. Hmm. I'm going to believe that the Ravens are going to be the head and the Steelers are going to be the tail with just double down implications. All right. Now, the Colts are definitely in the playoffs. Uh, I don't know if Texans are in the playoffs, but uh, uh, with the win last week, I think they probably are. So I don't even know if they're in the wild card uh, race right now. But it's still going to be a double down situation. This is the prime time seven fifteen game. I'm going to go with, of course, Texans is going to be the head. This is just one of my home teams. Texans is going to be the head, and Colts is going to be the tails. Uh, 12 p.m. game. So these games are going to go all over the map. Uh, 12 p.m. game on Sunday. Um, Jaguars versus Titans. I'm going to go Jaguars heads and Titans tails. All right. Now, this is a ride or die, and I hope that they could get to this because... Well, after the Lions uh, lost to the Cowboys, I think they might have to go to the wild card round. I don't know. I don't know if they're even in the playoffs at all. But, yeah, but I'm going with Vikings all the way. Uh, that's a ride or die team for the uh, 12 o'clock game on Saturday. Oh, that was, no, Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Long shot. <sighs> Okay, so the Falcons and the Saints are in action um, for the final time of the season. I'm going to go Falcons, the head, and the Saints at the tails. And, well, one double down, and now another, and, and then now a, uh, no, uh, another uh, ride or die. So, 
I'm going to go with the Jets because I don't like the Pats. I still don't like the Pats, so Jets all the way. Really? Really? Okay, okay. I'm going to have a... I'm going to... I'm going to for the last week, I can't believe I'm going to say this, but for the last week of the regular season, there's not going to be a pick. Why? I'll tell you why. I refuse to pick between the Buccaneers, Tampa Bay, and the Panthers. And you already know my history is about the Panthers. And you already know the history about the Buccaneers. So, for the first time ever on the last game of the regular season... I have a refused pick. I refuse to pick between the Buccaneers and the Panthers. All right. There we go. Moving on. Okay. So now we got the Battle of the Bees again for the last time in, in the regular season. The Browns and the Bengals. Well, after the Bengals have been manhandled by the Chiefs, I'm going to say I want the Browns to be the head and the Bengals to be the tails. So, all right. Finally, there's a 325 on Sunday. Um, yeah, 325 on Sunday. Uh, being the Bears versus the Green Bay Packers. I think the Packers have a, a good chance of beating the Bears, but it's going to be a double down because the Bears might have something up their sleeves. I'm going to have the Packers at the tail. No, Packers at the head and the Bears at the tail. There you go. Ride or die. Ride or die. And why have the Cowboys have to... And now it's the battle of the seed now. <laughs> we just had the last battle of the bees. And now we have the last battle of the seeds in, in, in the, uh, the, the last ga uh, few games of the regular season. Oh, my God. Cowboys and the most stupidest team... In the history of the NFL, stay with me, the Commanders. Yeah. So you know how I'm going with this. The Cowboys. That's easy. That's easy. Ride or die. All right. Uh, well, there's a lot of 325 games here. Wow. So I guess the afternoon game is going to pick up the slack since there's no Thursday or no Monday game. Okay, okay. Bronco versus uh, Raiders. Well, I still say, even though that they're not going to be in the playoffs, I, I don't think, uh, I'm going to say the Broncos will be the head and the Raiders will be the tails, even though the Raiders are one of my other teams. But still, um. Yeah, I don't think the Raiders is going to be in the playoffs anytime soon unless they could uh, take a, uh, uh, sneak in the wild card path. But I don't know. I don't know. All right. So, um, Eagles, Giants, another double down. Uh, the Eagles will be the head and the Giants will be the tails. Seahawks, Cardinals. I say the... The house is going to be the head, and the Cardinals is going to be the tails. There's going to be two double downs, two double downs, on the last two 325 games. First, the Titans, the Rams, which I hate, against the 49ers. So, right off the bat, you already know who I'm going to pick at the Riders IT. I'm picking the 49ers right off the gate. I don't want the Rams to win. I don't want them to win. Another one, Chiefs versus uh, Chargers. Now, um, the uh, the coach and some of the uh, some of the coaches are thinking about resting their starters for the playoffs. Would that be a good idea? Would that not be a good idea? I don't know. So, a lot of the starters may be resting for the postseason. And they're playing against the Chargers? We're going to have to see. So, I'm still going to go ride or die with the Chiefs, but I don't know. I'm kind of having questions about that, though. Now, I can see Patrick Mahomes resting, and then they tie a different quarterback for just for that one game. 
or maybe resting Travis K for that one game. I don't know. I don't know. But, okay. So, the last match, the last game of the 2023-2024 NFL season puts Chief Justice of the Supreme Court's team, the Bills, versus the Dolphins. It's 7.20 p.m. kickoff, and you know what? It's going to be a double-down affair because we all know what the Dolphins are capable of. So, Yana, I would be worried about the Dolphins if I was you. They're, they're known to pack up some pretty, pretty big points. I mean, remember the Broncos? 70-20, to 20, and I was shocked. That I actually read that, so Yana, I would worry about the I would worry about the Dolphins if I were you. I would be really, really, really concerned, really concerned. So, but I'm gonna go with the uh the Bills for the head and the Dolphins as the tails. So there you have it. A very short. Now I don't have the wild card yet, so I don't know when are they gonna have the wild card. And the divisional rounds uh, posted yet. So it's going to be pretty crazy uh, to say the least. But that's it. That's week 18, the last ga- uh, game of the regular season NFL pickup for 2023-2024 season. So this is the part where everybody say it. Pretty J. Big D country, yeah.